Hey everybody, I'm here today to answer a simple car question about buying a used car. The question is, how many kilometers is okay when I'm looking at purchasing a used vehicle? Now the simple answer is that it all depends, and that's the most honest answer, but I will go into some specific numbers in this video for you. Now once again, it all depends on the car and how the car was treated. Now certain cars are meant to last hundreds of thousand kilometers certain cars are known to last over 250,000 kilometers easily other cars are known to last much fewer kilometers you know 150 is sort of their max amount that you see them at before they're kind of written off as not being usable anymore so it all depends on the type of car the make and the model of the car and it depends on how the car was treated now with that being said okay I've seen many cars that have 250 50,000 kilometers that are still in mint condition that run perfectly and I've also seen many cars that have 50,000 kilometers that have been abused that are ready to almost throw away or need a complete engine and transmission replacement so that's literally how it all depends it all depends on the car and how well it was treated now if you look at this specific car with this specific owner an imaginary car with an imaginary owner and the owner treats the car well at a hundred thousand kilometers the car is going to be in this condition this imaginary condition at 200,000 kilometers obviously the car is going to be in worse condition so if you look at the average used car okay the average used car at 200,000 kilometers is going to be in worse condition than the average used car at a hundred thousand kilometers but you still have to look at that specific vehicle now with that being said there are certain maintenance things and certain parts that are generally replaced at certain kilometer miles stones so keep that in mind as well but before you buy a used car first and foremost look at the number of kilometers and secondly you want to look at the car inspect the car does the condition of the car make sense for that amount of kilometers if you see a car that is 50,000 kilometers but it looks and feels like it's been driven for 300,000 kilometers I would not recommend buying that car on the other hand if you see a car that has 200,000 kilometers but looks and feels like it's only been driven for 50 50,000 kilometers then I think that that will would likely be a good purchase because that car is is going to be out aged with its with regards to its age compared to its number of kilometers meaning it's going to last much longer than you think it's going to last now it also depends on your car goals if you want to have a car for two to three years and you don't mind if it breaks down here and there and you replace a few parts then you can look at cars with 200 to 300,000 kilometers because if you get a good car in decent condition with that many kilometers it might still last you two to three years without a problem it's very possible very likely depending on when you inspect it and you look into it a little bit further on the other hand if you don't want to do any repairs and you want a car that's going to last you like eight to ten years then you should not look at a car with that many kilometers you should be looking at cars with 20,000 40,000 kilometers because they're going to be more likely to last you that long it's unlikely that if you get a car with 200 250,000 kilometers that it's going to last you another eight years it very well might but it's very very unlikely and if it does you're probably gonna have to pump a lot of money into it with regards to repairs so the quick answer is that it all depends but the more in-depth answer is that it depends on a few things first and foremost you're looking at how well the car has been treated the condition of the car do the number of kilometers on the odometer match up with the way that the car looks and feels does the car look and feel like it's been abused look at the owner look at the condition of the interior and the exterior look at the condition of the engine look at the make and model and the average number of kilometers that you see on used cars of that make and model before they sort of get written off as being unusable okay also look at you know a whole variety of factors to make your decision also what are your car goals keep that in mind that's the best way that I could answer that question with regards to how many kilometers are okay when looking at buying a used car if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment what is the maximum number of kilometers that you would consider when you're looking at buying a used car let me know down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching